This morning, we're looking into how the U.S. Forest Service is gearing up for the busy Memorial Day weekend. Action News Now reporter Taylor Helms is live at the Santa Moody Boat Launch in Shasta Lake. Uh, Taylor, what has the Forest Service done to help get rid of some of that driftwood? Kelly, contractors are coming out as early as today to start clearing out some of the driftwood piling up here. Shasta County Recreation Officer Joe Steubendick says that they work with a campground and boat ramp concessionaire that helps clear out the driftwood using a tractor. He says it can take anywhere between an hour, three hours, even a whole day to collect and pull out the driftwood. Steubendick says the winds are a huge factor in where and how much driftwood piles up. They're out here um, when we know that it's bad, um, but it's not all the time. Um, unfortunately, like I said, with the winds shifting, we'll have times where the driftwood will be in like this and then the winds will shift and all the driftwood gets pushed away. So that tractor will come out, try to do the work, and then it's, you know, it's cleared already. So mm -hmm. it's a very dynamic situation that um, we're just doing what we can to stay ahead of it. After the driftwood is piled up out of the lake and pulled out, they use log booms and boats to corral it and pull it onto shore. Steubendick says once the driftwood is collected, they'll burn it so that this driftwood isn't a problem in the future. Steubendick says that the winds are a huge factor, like I said, and if they're blowing from the northwest into the cove like this one here at Santa Moody Boat Launch, that's when the most driftwood will pile up. Reporting live at Shasta Lake, Taylor Helms, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Thanks, Taylor. The U.S. Forest Service will also be setting up booms on the lake to collect even more driftwood sometime this week when the winds are in their favor.